The lens is all fogged up. It looks like you're walking through a cloud. Am I swimming through a cloud now? Hmm. I don't think you can swim in the cloud. Every day is a new day. And I smile in a new way. Every time I get to watch family. Because I've flown through them and the plane doesn't swim like a boat. It flies. Oh. We're having boom oh. sauce chicken and rice, which is a custom sauce creation of mine. But it's delicious. It is getting that more is and awesome. more foggy. Really? Yeah, time to clean off the lens. So now I'm flying? Yes, you are flying through the fog. <laughs> <laughs> That right there is the moon. That is a beautiful sunset. What are you doing, buddy? I'm picking up apples. Picking up apples? Let me turn the ISO up so I can see you. It's a drop. It's really not that bright outside right now, but it looks like midday. <laughs> because this camera is so amazing. Look at all these beautiful red delicious apples. I don't even know if they're red delicious, but I don't know what they are. Kyle is earning some rewards in our behavior ro reward program that we do at home um, by picking up all the apples that blew off the tree that are good apples. Whoa. Stepping on half of them, picking up the others. <laughs> that looks cool. You're too hard on your freaking self. Don't even be hard on your bad self. I don't see it yet. That is an awesome looking sunset. It looks good on the viewfinder. Well, it is awesome. I'm looking right at it. <laughs> Here's the problem with when you're painting is when you're all up in it and you're the one with the brush and you're getting paint on your neck and stuff. Am I? Yep. <laughs> oh, it's like you were thinking. He's like, hmm. You put this paintbrush up there. Hmm. But uh, yeah, when you, you have to step back like 10 feet from a painting to really see what you've done. Yeah. And what it looks like. And I think it looks really good. I think it looks really cool. So you're going, you're, Ginger's, she's not a wasteful person. So I bought all those acrylics and that's why she's painting with acrylics instead of oils. Let's be honest. But <laughs> Ginger's paintings thus far only deserve the small canvases and the acrylic paints. Whatever. Hey, the that's first two I that did. I did, I did on the small ones before I started feeling more confident. I'm just like, I don't know. Well, here's what I think you should do. I'm going to challenge you right now. You ready? I don't want to be challenged. No. <laughs> A special challenge. <laughs> I think... Now that you are doing this one on acrylic, uh -huh. you should find a similar one with like a bright sky like that. Yeah. And I'll just give you a few pointers on it and you do it and then you try it with oil and you'll be amazed at how much better it looks. I'm sure. Because of how much you, how easy it is to, to really blend the colors and get everything to go smooth and stuff. There's a few little techniques you can do with oil that you cannot do with acrylic. That's really cool. I guarantee you, I'll try it. I think this Ew. looks freaking awesome, but I, I'm telling you right now, if you if you use those high quality oil paints and the nice brushes and everything, uh, you would it would blow your mind how much cooler that would look. Oh yeah, and it, but it does look way cool, right? We'll see once we get, once I get it like, <laughs> it feels muddy and just like. No, it looks really good. I think it looks really cool. Whatever. Hi. Do you want to show them what we just made? Yes. So we had another YouTuber send us a package. It's um, MBM Crafts. Oh, it's made one. by Mommy Crafts. And they sent us a package and said, just make whatever you want out of it. You can only use glue and like scissors. And so, <laughs> there it is. sometimes I'm really creative.
creative and sometimes I'm not. But Kyle, this was Kyle's deal and he did such a good job. You can't really see the feet. No, but that is an adorable turkey. Look at all those feathers. Look at this head. <laughs> <laughs> it's awesome. It's awesome, right? Yeah. So that video will go up on my gingerific channel next week. And it's kind of funny because we don't know what we're doing. See that? All the painting is happening all the time. You guys should have seen me and Carl balling like babies last night. We put up our second painting, well, Carl's second painting on eBay, and the bid immediately, basically immediately went to $1,000. What? You guys, thank you. It's so awesome. Like, this is helping us so much. You know, we're saving our money, and then with the contributing money, it's gonna be going, it's gonna go so much faster. So we just felt really inspired to paint last night and to, like, get stuff that you guys, get stuff done that you guys are gonna like. So check out this one that Carl did, it's so good. Isn't that beautiful? That's yeah. like, that's like a real Idaho, like winter sunset. It's so pretty. Look at this one. Oh, do you like that one? Yeah. Yeah, that one's really good. This one, my dad figured out the mountains on that one. Yeah, he did. You've heard us talking a lot about painting, huh? Yeah. Yeah. But guys, I just think this is so pretty. I love the colors in that because it just seems to like, I don't know, it speaks to me. So here's an Instagram photo that Shay Carl took and it was recommended in the comments uh i got challenged to try and paint that sunset so i did there it is right there i did that last night and i think it turned out pretty darn good so you've got the mountains and the sunset and everything like that of course i mean it's not exactly like <laughs> the photo that he took but it's got the mountains down there and the little trees and the foothills and and I think as far as a painting goes, for only being like my fifth or sixth try, I don't even know how many tries I've done now, I think it turned out pretty cool. I like it. So everybody should go tweet Shay Carl and tell him to check out and follow me on Instagram. He's like a good friend of mine, and he's so busy, he doesn't even follow me on Instagram, so he probably didn't even see the painting that I did. <laughs> Whatever, I'm gonna see him tomorrow anyway, so I'll just tell him then, show him the pictures, it doesn't really matter, so don't bug him, I was just joking. Got a package. It's just for me. It has my name on it. Oh, sweet. Whoa. I actually know what it is. What is it? Can't say. Or I can. It's a hair oil. Oh, cool. You can do a video with it? Yeah. Awesome. He just sent it to me. It's a new product. I guess people just like me for my hair. We'll get full of ourselves now. <laughs> this right here is my first painting, the very first one that sold on eBay and uh, it is going in recycled Amazon Prime packaging. Because we recycle That's and right. reuse. <laughs> so this painting is getting mailed out today. Uh, we picked someone, one of our followers, um, and we were very careful in particular about the selection of who this painting was going to. And so it's going in the mail today so you can look forward to that and you know who you are and you also know who you are that actually bought this painting and donated it and those funds and you are an amazing person. And you are an angel. Thank you. I don't even know what to think you guys. It doesn't even feel real to me. I look what? That second painting, which I think is probably the least of the paintings that I've done, I mean, let's be honest. It's not about that. It has that. nothing to do with the painting. It has to do with people being awesome. Uh, I know. We were like boo-hoo and ball babies all night last night. It's, a thousand, it's at $1,000. It. That's a, for most people. Like, for us, that's a lot of money. That's a lot of money. It's a lot, yeah. It's we 
are treating every penny that gets auctioned off and every penny that comes into the Patreon page or any of that, we are treating it as sacred funds. Absolutely. Uh, we are putting it in that special account and leaving it alone until the time is right to go forward with the adoption and start paying those things off. Yeah. So we are so grateful. Can't even believe it. I don't even know what to say. I never know what to say other than thank you. That's all I know how to say. It's a huge blessing to us and we really do appreciate it. It's amazing. And it helps when you grit your teeth like this and just talk through your teeth because it's so motivational. <laughs> that face says it all right there. Deer in the headlights right there, right? <laughs>